The Forum of Trajan was the largest forum built by an emperor, and it was gargantuan. But not only is it really impressive in scale, it's also how fast they built it. When you compare the speed with which they built the Forum of Trajan, it's a fraction of time as it took to build the Forum of Augustus, not even 100 years before. The Forum of Trajan was financed by the conquest of Dacia, which is modern-day Romania. The Dacian campaigns take place in two major phases, and they're narrated on the outer spiral of Trajan's column. Trajan's Column is one of the quintessential pieces within Trajan's form that makes it so impressive. Still today, the column stands, originally topped by a statue of Trajan. Today, it's of Peter, one of the patron saints of Rome. Originally, the column was flanked by two structures that are identified as libraries, Latin and Greek. And maybe on one side, there was a temple of Trajan. Other hypotheses by excavators identify some of the monumental remains one monolithic column, as being a grand entrance or propylion. The gigantic Basilica Ulpia, named after the family of Trajan, was mesmerizing, and the entire roof system was covered in gilded bronze panels. And between the Basilica Ulpia and the two libraries, most of the view of the column was hidden away, and most of the narration on the outer part of Trajan's column was hidden from view. In fact, a much more successful display of narration on a large column takes place in the sequel, and that is the column of Marcus Aurelius in the nearby Campus Martius. The Forum Piazza was massive in scale, and to match that, there was a colossal-sized equestrian statue of Trajan himself in gilded bronze. The actual base is preserved, but of course the statue has long since disappeared. Many architectural features of the Forum of Trajan mimic and echo a lot of features from previous forums, such as the hemicycles that appear on either end of the Basilica Ulpia and even along the Forum Piazza itself. They copy or replicate the exedri and apses that take place and are located in the Forum of Augustus. Apollodorus of Damascus was a great builder and architect under the Emperor Trajan, and to him is credited Forums Trajan, possibly the Column of Trajan, definitely the Baths of Trajan on the Esquiline Hill, and quite possibly the Markets of Trajan. What are the Markets of Trajan? Now this is a modern term given to a series of brick structures along the Quirinal Hill. The Markets of Trajan have a different purpose from the form of Trajan because of the building materials involved. Markets of Trajan is entirely built of brick and vaulted concrete, whereas when you look at the remains of the form of Trajan, it's entirely built of marble, solid blocks of marble. And so you have two different spaces with two different functions. Possibly the so-called markets of Trajan, named by the excavators, was an administrative center, or it was a shopping mall. Over the passing of time from the Middle Ages, the pavement is ripped out and it becomes farmland. It becomes occupied by a neighborhood. As Rome's population shrank, people needed open spaces to develop, ultimately for farmland and orchards. And those remains have been excavated. But over time, you have the accretion of later buildings. And when you look in the piazza today, you see the remains of those later structures, at least the remains of them, after excavations as late as the 1990s and early 2000s. When you look at the markets of Trajan today, what you see is something very well preserved, in part because it was buried, and in part because it was still in use. It became in the Middle Ages a fortification, and there was the construction of the massive domineering still today, Torre della Milizia, which is 50 meters high, the height of the Colosseum, slightly leaning. And with the passing of time from castle, the Marks of Trajan were transformed into a convent. And ultimately, when those trappings were stripped away in the time of the fascist era, you have a very pristine looking Marks of Trajan still preserved and still accessible today.